everybody, Rick Needham from the Big M, <clears throat> the Meadowlands, in East Rutherford, New Jersey. It's Friday evening, January the 4th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle YouTube day at the track.com race of the day. I'm going to focus on race 6 this evening, folks. It goes to the post at 8.40 p.m. Eastern. Phillies and Mares pacing for a $37,500 purse. Contenders number 5, you better think, think. Number 2, Ulrika Bromac. Number eight, up from Dragonfly, and number three, Riley Rose. Number five, you better think, think, is won each of her last five outings with her last two circle trips also qualifying as power runs. Driver Ianna Gingrass and trainer Mickey Brooks sent her to the rolling gate tonight. They fit the board with 56% of nearly 400 entries harnessed to date. Number two, Ulrika Bromack, a New Zealand bred entry, is the morning line favorite. Gets a return ride from drive, driver Brian Sears tonight. Sears has been in her sulky on three previous occasions, winning each time. Guns for the Grand Slam tonight. Race six summary, number five, you better think, think. Tops my contenders list, which also includes the New Zealand bred number two, Ulrika Bromack, number eight, up from Dragonfly, and number three, Riley Rose. That's 5283 in the sixth tonight from the Big M. A couple of bonus long shots for you as usual, folks. Let's go to Woodbine in Canada, the 12 to 1 bomb. Number six, Winston Countess qualifies as a power pony. It's nice speed for tonight's pace. <clears throat> at Pompano Park in Florida. Check out number four all night long, a 15 to 1 bomb. The Trackmaster Plus Power Pony is decent speed for this pace tonight. So from the Meadowlands on a uh, Friday evening, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle YouTube and dayatthetrack.com reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.